You know, Pelosi, that's a very good place for you in the depths of hell. Because for some reason, you have a very bad obsession of getting us into war. Hey, why is it that you did not admit that there were, w there were no WMDs in Iraq? You could have, you lied us into a war in Iraq. You got us into an invasion in Afghanistan. Now over 90% of those people are impoverished and are dying. Why don't you tell the truth about Nord Stream? Why didn't we destroy Nord Stream? We're leaving millions of Germans without energy. You have a knack for getting us into war. People like you should be arrested. You are a war criminal. Hey, Congresswoman, I came to see a warmonger, but you're a sad old drunk. Get out. What happened? Get out. When you went to Get Taiwan, out. were you looking for Get Ukraine? Out. Get Did out. we blow up the Nord Get Stream out. on accident or on purpose? Get Did you know about Get that? Out. Aren't you supposed to be part of the indictment tomorrow? You're a war criminal by definition, Miss Pelosi. You got some nerve. Is that why you're here in Manhattan? Is that why you're here? Because you're getting indicted tomorrow, you goddamn war criminal? How many people have died in your fucking name? How, how many people have died because of Iraq? All of you forgot about Iraq? Iran, Libya, Syria. Don Hank was always never going to work. If we don't deal with the 600 trillion in derivatives, then there's no chance for this economy. Don't you see it all fail? None of it works. None of it works. We need to be the Democrats to have an And then you land your plane in Taiwan, we want a war with China at the same time. We want to all have nuclear bombs dropped on our heads. We live in Manhattan. I have to ask you to leave. Thank you. By the way, Lyndon LaRouche is back in a big way, and I'm here on behalf of everybody who loves peace and not war with Russia and war with China and a new hot war with the East.